Hello everyone. Today let us uh, figure out how to download Jira. Now, I was thinking of making a video on uh, installing Jira on server because I have one uh, hard disk with Windows 10 which I pulled out from uh, one of my laptop and uh, occasionally I do use that hard disk. I insert that hard disk in my laptop and I play Windows based games, retro games mostly. But uh, I was thinking of uh, also making a video on how to install Jira on Windows. When I started doing something with Jira, when I first uh, started learning Jira, I was actually uh, working for a company where I was maintaining a, a tool called Microsoft Project Server. And that tool was installed on uh, a Windows based server. And when I started trying Jira, I used that server to install Jira. So my very first experience of uh, installing Jira was actually on the Windows uh, server. But in almost 80 to 90 percent uh, of cases where I have to install Jira or upgrade Jira or any other Atlassian tools, it is mostly on uh, Linux based servers. But I believe uh, people also use uh, Windows based servers to install Jira. I mean, uh, yes, you can. You can, uh, you can install Jira on um, Windows as well because Jira needs JVM. So as long as you have JVM, you can uh, use uh, Jira on that particular uh, server. Now, today I thought I will make a video on uh, installation of Jira on the server version, or I mean the server version on Windows, but it took me a while to figure out uh, where to download the installer. I think Atlassian is trying really hard to promote their cloud version and uh, it is not very simple and easy to f to find out the installer for uh, for Jira that we can use to maybe play or evaluate Jira on a server. So today let us do that and uh, in this video we will not install Jira but we will figure out how to find the installer. So if you go to the atlassian.com website you can click on products and then you can go to Jira software and uh, when you go to Jira software then of course you can find few things like uh, get it for free. So if you click on let us say get it for free because you want to evaluate it and you want to use it for maybe uh, maybe uh, for trying out few things. So if, when you click on it, you are actually taken this to, to this page where you have the option to click on next. And by the way, it is uh, talking about uh, I believe uh, cloud products earlier. I, I guess a few months back, there was and there used to be a link at the very bottom called uh, other download options or other options where you were able to find the, find the installer. But not right now. Let us click on the next button. So I'm basically trying to figure out where I can find the installer. So let us see. Let, let, us, let us keep on looking. So now we have the option to sign up. But there is no link here called uh, download or uh, uh, on prem. So let's go back. And uh, I'll probably go back to the original page. Now when you, initially we clicked on the get it free, but uh, on top you can find this option called enterprise. Now as you all know, hopefully that there is no Jira server version, there is in fact Jira data center version. So that is why I guess you need to click on enterprise because when you click on enterprise, you still have option to try or look at the cloud premium or cloud enterprise. But if you scroll down further, you have the option to try or do something with the data center version. So let us click on this button contact sales, but I, I don't really want to contact sales. I just want the installer. So if, if you click on it, let us see if we can find the installer here. So let us get started. I hope they will give me a link here to download. 
Jira, but no, there is a form to contact the sales team, which I don't really want to do. I want to install Jira and I want to play with it. So let us go back. And there is also one more link here called learn more. If I click on it, I now have a different page, which looks like the page where we started earlier, but this time it is for the enterprise. So now if you click on try it for free, you can then hopefully find an option to download Jira, but not yet. G uh, Atlassian is trying here to try it on either AWS or uh, Azure, which I don't really want to, but I want to simply click on this uh, link here called check out our download archive. So this is what you need. And this was the link that we used to click earlier when uh, we used to click on uh, try it for free. So I guess hopefully I should be able to now figure out the link so I can try the latest version or maybe the earlier version if I want. For example, I can, uh, by the way, uh, click on the 7.0 and I can find all the links for 7.0. And there is also a link here called Jira Server Download Archive in case you are drawing, in case you are upgrading from very old version of Jira, maybe from Jira 4 or 3. Yeah, that, that is still the case. A lot of people are still using very old versions of Jira and they need to upgrade it to first 5.4, then 6 point something, and then to 7, and then and of course to 8 point something. But uh, we want to install the latest version. So if you click on the Get Started, you can then uh, select the operating system. So maybe you want to install the bin or maybe you want to install, install the exe file, I guess. Or maybe if you're doing the installation manually, you can select uh, tar.gz. So this is what we'll do. This is what we'll do hopefully in the uh, in the video where we will show, we will we will we will, we will learn how to install Jira on a server version. So to be honest, if you have reached this page, this is actually 90% of the effort. So finding the link is actually more difficult than <laughs> installing Jira on server version. So what we'll do in the next video, hopefully in the next video, we'll uh, install Jira on a server version. Of course, this is uh, for data center version, but if you're evaluating Jira, you can still install it on your local machine and you can uh, uh, play with it if you want. So this is something that I will definitely do because on my channel, I'm sure you know that uh, I'm only focused on Atlassian tools but I never really talked about installing Jira on Windows. I think I did cover installing Jira or upgrading Jira on server version, but uh, definitely not on uh, Windows based operating system. So that, that is what we'll do. We'll uh, probably use the installer. And if you click on submit button here, you can find the exe file that will uh, that will be using to install Jira. So that is all I wanted to cover in this video. I wanted to basically show you how to find the installer. So I hope you enjoyed watching this video and you learned something new today. Thank you very much.